I have a special guest on the line. Uh, he's going to speak to us. Uh, with any luck, I should now be able to speak to Keith. Are you there, mate? Hello, mate. Yeah, how are you Hi, doing, Hi, Keith. I'm not so bad. How are you? I'm good, man. Um, right. Signified. Signified. Uh, we started um, 2006, Ash Welsh um, on vocals, Brian Hill on bass, myself on drums, and a guy called Rob McBurney, who was the original guitarist. Um, and not long after, he went to do a solo project, and then Ash, being a guitarist, um, took over the guitar duties, and there we are, we're a three-piece, and it's uh, worked out good. Uh, well, I'll tell you what, I've listened to the new EP, and I'll tell you what, you're sounding good. You oh, really are you. sounding good. Um, you did an EP, was it 2007, Invasion of Piracy, and that did quite well for, over Europe, and as well as England. Sure, yeah, I mean, that, that's, um, I mean, we got that out, and there was a bit of a gap between, because we sort of scrapped two EPs. Which sounds mad, <laughs> but um, basically it was we didn't really find the, the sound that we've got now. It took a while to actually, you know, sort of get it going and uh, and get it to where we where we wanted it to sound. Um, so yeah, we scrapped two EPs. So um, there was a bit of a gaff. But yeah, the, the invasion of piracy it was it was played across uh, quite a few radio stations across the world and that like. I was going to say because I've actually read uh, some of the write-ups. Have you? you've had some uh, pretty good write-ups. Sure. Uh, rockradio. dot com. Uh, you're an artist of the week on uh, Top Rock Radio. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's nice that you know people like it. I mean, you know, it's like any band um, aspiring to go out there and do the thing. You know, all power to them. But it, it's nice um, that someone you know listens to what you're doing. It's um, yeah, you're doing the right thing. I, I, well, I honestly believe you know, kudos to the likes of yourselves and any band out there who go on stage, sing, and play their own instruments. There's sure. not enough of it nowadays. And as far as I'm concerned, well done, lads. Well done. Oh, nice. Well, the Liverpool scene is uh, is thriving for, for rock bands and, and metal bands and like. I mean, there's the Liverpool scene is uh, is really sort of you know it's pumping at the moment. It's uh, a lot of good bands. I mean, it's, there's a lot of good bands around, and they just gotta just keep going for it. You know. I don't think they'll allow me in Liverpool. <laughs> no, come over for a beer, man. <laughs> I'll come over for a beer if you get into me safety getting back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we could do that, yeah. We'll right. something else. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to play what I think, well, for me, I think it's the uh, best track on the EP. Yeah. I'm going to play uh, Edge of Your Seat. Yeah, it's a good track, yeah. And uh, when we get back, uh, we'll chat for a few more minutes, then I'm going to let you pick the uh, final song off it to play out with. How's about that? Cool. That sounded very uh, Jimmy Savile, that. Yeah. <laughs> Right, I'm going to play this. Uh, this is Signified, and this is Edge of Your Seat. This is the MRO Friday Night Rock Show with me, Stevie Howard, and Signified. <laughs> Signified there, and Edge of Your Seat. Cracking chat, absolutely love that. You still there, Keith? I sure am, yeah. Uh, before we go any further, I've had an email here. Okay. I think you may know the gentleman in question, uh, Mr David Sadler. Yes, yes. He says, I've got to ask you which character you'd be if you were in the A-Team or Battlestar Galactica. And I think that sort of gives it away, I asking for both yeah, of them. I think I'd have to be phased. He's awful, he's I awful. Know. When you see him, give him a slap for I me, will. will you? Shame on you, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, touring. I believe you're going to be doing a tour of the North West uh, soon. Yeah, yeah, well, still about, like, uh, four or five gigs we've got to um, have confirmed, but at the moment we've got in third, Mojo, Liverpool, uh, 21st, Corova, Liverpool, 23rd, Levenue, uh, Newport, um, 24th, Barfly, Cardiff, 26th, The Crazy House, Liverpool, and I think there's one being lined up for Manchester, maybe going into March, but there's, there's quite a few um, being sort of backwards and forwards until we confirm it, and, uh, and we're hoping to get back over to Europe as well in March, which which will be really cool. Just keep checking out the the MySpace, MySpace dot com slash Signified Band, um, and just keep keep checking out because more dates are going to be added as the weeks go by. Yeah. But, um, so we're just, we, I mean, that's what we're really about. We're a live band at the end of the day, so we just want to get out there and play A to Z, UK, Europe, and and anywhere else we can. Well, you watch it. If you keep me uh, up to date with things that are going on, I sure will. Make yeah. sure that everybody out here gets to know. Before yeah. you were saying you know, like you um, dumped t uh, two EPs worth of music. Yeah. Is it true that you actually tried out a load of the material uh, when you were out on tour in Europe and UK, so you could see what was good and what wasn't? Yeah, I mean that's always the way. You just see what works, and um, I mean you've obviously got to please yourself first and foremost as a musician. Um, but it's just nice to see reaction of what goes down. But a lot of it was, I think it was just a transitional sort of period, and then we started writing sort of more 
uh, we, we've just got freer when we were writing stuff. It was, wasn't a case of we well, thought we had to sound like this. It was just let's go in rehearsal room from scratch and just yeah. what well, it comes out like, and it just comes out. You know, it sounds fresh to us. But yeah, I think it was probably wise. I mean, most bands would be like, you know, you, you shouldn't really have to put that much effort in to scrap an EP and never mind two. But uh, it would have been <laughs> bad putting them out because it wasn't representing what we, where we were at. Yeah. Right, uh, but before I let you go, you've got to pick the next track off the EP. I'll pick Suddenly. We shall have that. Next one. Um, all I can say, thanks for coming on. Sure, no problem, mate. Excellent. And uh, I can certainly see big things ahead for you as well. Most definitely. Uh, good luck to you, Ash and Brian, anyway, and uh, hope to see you when you're up in Manchester. If not, I'll... Uh, I have to sort of yeah, wind you know, my we'll way we'll across. Sort out that. We'll sort out getting you home safely, mate. Come over to Liverpool. Right, I'll come over to Liverpool and have a night out. This is Suddenly on MRO Friday Night Rock Show from Signified.